people have different measures of success they act like our parents like we hate the mentality of our parents yeah but at the same time they do act like our parents right so <laughs> so how will a common crowd judge a person's success or yeah. failure yeah well how much money do you make how how much properties do you own how much popularity do you have like i've talked to sponsors as well and all they care about are views <laughs> like, yeah exactly like you have this many views you have this many subscribers well if i had to get a lot of views i could do Easily. roasting i could yeah. do <laughs> lip syncing why would i run a goddamn podcast this is the worst thing to get views man that one too. hour long 90 percent of people don't even click it <laughs> looking, <laughs> looking that, at too, that too with no clickbaits <laughs> yeah with no clickbaits with with topics like a different trajectory half people did not understand the meaning of that yeah and keeping the uh, the language english <laughs> yeah. we should do like hindi and talk about relationships and, all the time and and put thumbnails like this ye nahi dekha to kuch nahi dekha ye nahi dekha to paida hone ka koi fayda nahi yeah so so yeah we we in general and we are all culprit of that yeah. sometimes or the other we all look at the views and the number of followers exactly that pains mm. me a lot ashish just now you said <laughs> that you are not successful you are you're putting your 100% mm. and it does not mean where you are like then i think uh, elon yeah. musk and jeff Be- bezos they should be the uh, most successful people. yeah but they must not be if you, they must not be they may not be maybe yeah may not be i just uh, use the wrong word they mm. may not be right yeah so it depends on a person's perception maybe elon musk maybe he's aiming for mars civilization and he's still at the starting point and he's not considering himself as successful mm. right yeah. so everyone's agenda is different everyone's uh, definition is different and someone's i think most of the people's definition is getting fame getting lot of money that mm-hmm. is success and that is bullshit according <laughs> to me that really pisses me off when someone says like i remember one time one person said to me uh oh, she she has a make a big name in the industry nobody knows her something like that in mm. comment like mm. excuse me mm. <laughs> like like that can be according to your definition but according to me i'm putting my 100% mm. i'm uh, struggling i'm going forward i'm better than the yesterday i'm liking myself more than yesterday yeah. and i ask myself that have i mm, made improvements mm. i always say yes i have made improvements yeah. and that's what success is yeah so yeah. so if you if you start talking about people who are more successful are the artists who yeah. go for very unconventional routes let us say a person left his job to become a singer all right now everyone will appreciate that but then we have different standards it's like levels of cages that is always going to be over there now yeah. now that person has to get so many hits so many downloads needs to get signed by this record level yeah so so it is always again now you are going to roll with the punches listen to what people are saying so why did you leave your job then yeah you could have listened to other people by yeah. following that same old rusty route that you were told to follow yeah so it's it always gets you so i i made one talk thought video which is a series you might not know about but its topic was sooner or later the world will get you yeah and <laughs> and just leaving your job or going for an unconventional path is not sufficient let us say everyone told you that you cannot be a good hockey player and you said i can be a good hockey player and then you went out over there yeah and then you again over time started to roll with the punches this is what you need to do and then it becomes your job so ultimately it remains the same thing yeah we have seen lot of people know they are telling me down the line in mm. fact i'll talk about my profession only mm-hmm. because yeah uh, i have the experience with that only so mm. i have heard very recognized models talking to them mm. so they have told me like uh, after 3 4 years you'll get bored bored yeah i i don't think so like it should not if you are getting bored then it is not your passion hmm because it should be something which keeps you moving we do get bored but not forever it's not like i don't want to do it they get me. bored for forever and they yeah. just stop doing it it's like it. you take a break that is yeah. a different thing yeah th- that is okay that hmm. is i'm not saying i'm saying boredom 
for a longer term longer term yeah like bored we always get bored if we are keep doing the stuff for 24 hours 48 hours obviously i need a break yeah. not that kind of bored bored like on a permanent level saturation kind yeah, of yeah yeah bored if i say bored term then mm. it's on a permanent level yeah so i've seen people mm-hmm. so uh, i don't think so mm-hmm. that uh, i will ever be bored mm. of my profession mm. because i know how much excited i am when i am i'm on the shoot matter of and fact one if, day of if the you shoot. really like it you'll feel like one lifetime is not sufficient exactly. to do all that i want to do yeah right? and you'll find it i always say it you'll always find yourself uh, doing it in daily habits mm-hmm. and if you have been if it is in your daily habits then you have been doing it for the time you have lived here on the earth mm. right and so if you haven't been bored for this much time so how can you be bored for that much equal time mm. ahead in the future yeah right so i never got bored of making videos exactly yeah. because you love that yeah i never got bored of making podcast either yeah mm-hmm. i did not get bored of martial arts for how long have i been doing so what i was saying is that nowadays because of the whole social media thing people are just so stuck to numbers almost like we are mm-hmm. computers exactly what what else measures everything with numbers computers so we are becoming computers that's a new simulation theory by the way i must be <laughs> writing a book on that <laughs> right so we are becoming computers now and computers are becoming human which will control us later yeah. they are becoming becoming more and more intelligent and artificial intelligence is going to yeah they are producing more and more bo- bots and bots. then they are <laughs> increasing the likes views oh, yeah. and numbers of followers and subscribers <laughs> everywhere <laughs> yeah right when yeah. people try to play you play them back yeah. <laughs> what if what if here's a con- conspiracy theory.